Hello YouTube and a special hello to the fighting community in Western Europe, bare knuckle fighting community. Uh, will Danny Christie beat the crap out of the shadow boxer? Well, that remains to be seen. Uh, Danny put a video out this morning entertaining the thought. Uh, I hope he does. Uh, I consider Danny, uh, me and Joe both, consider uh, Danny a friend of ours. And... The take I would get is this, this could possibly happen. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. Uh, our friends are always, uh, we don't have friends that discriminate uh, against the less learned uh we don't have friends that uh, discriminate against slow people, and uh, we just we just don't have friends that do that. So uh, I believe that uh, Mr. Christie may give the sideshow circus freak a shot that will remain to be seen but we'll see what happens can all but guarantee you it's going to be uh like a uk irish charlie z thing uh with deontay wilder think there's going to be that much to it. I think everybody that may be wanting to see this slow comedian popped and popped good into being fully fledged and fully knocked out or quickly quitting would love to see the fight. I would pay to see that. Uh, to all of our friends in the U.S., I would uh, go over and, uh, well, you don't have to go nowhere, but I'd go online on over to Danny Christie's YouTube and possibly look at how this has been brewing a little bit. You can go over and look at the other guy too. Uh, it's quite entertaining in this world. Uh, you know, something funny happened. You know, you, when I was a boy, you'd go to the circus and there'd always be a, for, what, what, it would be labeled and told outside the door, you know, a big sign that would say the freak show. And we would always go in there and it would be, uh, effeminate men with big long beards dressed up with makeup to look like a woman. Yeah, that's what the majority of that was. Imitating one woman that had a some type of hormonal problem that she really was able to grow a beard, but the circuses would go out and get these effeminate men put makeup on them, tell them to grow their beard out long, and you'd go in, you'd see that. As a little kid, you'd say, well, it's a woman. Wow. they go out and find somebody uh, 450 pounds, let them sit in a chair, eating the old timey buckets of Kentucky Fried Chicken. We go in there, oh my God, ain't never seen nobody that fat. 
and assorted other things. But you see today, it's no longer a freak show to go to at the circus because you can just walk outside and go down to the corner store there, a <laughs> little general store as we used to call them. But at any rate, you can go down to the corner store there and you can see a 450 pound guy or gal <laughs> wobbling up to the counter. Uh, they're all over the place nowadays. Uh, you can also go go down there to the corner and see a man with a beard down to here, muscular. Uh, with makeup on, hair down to his butt. It's nothing interesting in that no more. So a lot of the freaks and people like that have switched to try to get into sports. And the way they've done that is through internet uh, shenanigans and this is a good shenanigan here if anybody's interested in a fight if it were to happen uh, as I said we know Danny we love Danny here we consider Danny a friend of ours uh, I don't have no inside information I don't know nothing about nothing uh, but I'll tell you off of what I've seen on that latest video, he's entertaining the thought and he wasn't entertaining the thought any longer. So I hope he would be the one that would step forward and bash this guy up. Uh, you know, it's been said about the bacon over there, the shadow bacon, as they call him. Still living at home. He's in his 30s, living at home with mommy and daddy. Uh, no care in the world. Uh, all this, all that. Don't know how he's got all the money up to run all over the place. He was in the Orient before. Making funny videos with Mr. Karate that was on one of the Rambo movies. Uh, he's good and comedic, but this ain't the, ain't the thing to be getting into, uh, when you're good and comedic, uh, this thing to get into when you're good and serious. So maybe the shadow boxers went and done it, shadow bacon, pardon me. And maybe Mr. Christie We'll take him up on this thing. As for us in this house, we're hoping it happens. We are hoping it happens. So stay tuned, everyone. Uh, if it happens, if they can get it up on a pay-per-view, boy, we're going to be watching it. We will be sharing it out because it'll be a very interesting fight for all boxers, MMA, bare knuckle people to watch. This will be an event. So either how it goes, uh, we're okay, but we, we really want this one. This is the thing we really want to see. Uh, as a matter of fact, I would purchase it over half the pay-per-views coming up this year. So, uh, if you haven't seen much about the little feud and the bang, this comedian seems to wake up thinking Danny Christie all day long on YouTube shouting, Christy, 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 Christy. Uh, and before he goes to sleep, he's got Christy thoughts he puts out on YouTube. So he, this guy's, well, he's a freak. Uh, so go check that out. And if that fight happens, you guys are going to see something. Oh boy, are you going to see something? 